name is Peter Berlinger, and I am delighted to be here with Daryl Wilson from Wilson Audio. Daryl, how are you? I'm doing really well. Thanks for coming by, Peter. You have a new product that is the buzz of the show. Tell us all about it. We're really excited about the Alex. Um, we're taking what we've learned in the WAM for the last three and a half years of development mm -hmm. and for over 40 years of product development at Wilson Audio. Um, we've trickled that into a package that might be big, but it's really small for what it delivers. We've got the woofers from the WAM that we brought over to this product. We've got the mid-range from the XLF. Look at that. We've got the convergent synergy tweeter that uh, is used across the line. Oh, yeah. There we go. And then for uh, all you people that love the sound of the Sabrina, we've uh, uh, utilized the Sabrina mid-range um, for the top two octaves of the mid-range. Gosh. This seven-inch mid-range is uh, handling the lower two octaves mm -hmm. of the mid-range band. Mm -hmm. And then these new woofers um, are something that we're really proud of. Frequency response, top to bottom? Um, it goes from 20 uh, to 33K. Efficiency? Uh, 91 dB. Wow, very cool. Yeah. The Max 3 was also 91 dB. The mm -hmm. Alexia is 90 dB. Mm -hmm. uh, per channel, it's 452 pounds. Mm -hmm. uh, the Max 3 is 420 pounds. Mm -hmm. It's about 32 pounds heavier per mm -hmm. channel. And the uh, Alexia is uh, 200 pounds lighter per channel. Just, oh. you know, some references. I understand. But I, I, I really wanted this to be... Um, an integrated design where the wings and the woofer that. cabinet come together with really fluid and organic lines. Yeah, look at that. You can see it right here and how it comes. That's beautiful. Then on the top of the upper mid-range module, you see the lines coming through also onto the wings. Look at that. Stunning. Show us the back. So the wings um, also form a frame for the resistor axis on the back. So this is a prototype. I'm so this is just you. yeah, this is yeah. just a sticker, and then yeah. these will be anodized and whatnot. But yeah. this will be a carbon fiber plate that mm -hmm. backdrops the resistors. Mm -hmm. um, these um, aluminum heat sinks are also thicker than what we've been using with other ones, so it's more efficient at you know pulling heat away from the resistors. There you go. That's smart. And then I've always loved the way the inside of a watch looks. I've always thought, how do I get that onto a speaker? And so this is, you know, my attempt at, you know, making, you know, that type of, of connection and really trying to make that part of the product beautiful. You are one gifted designer. Let me tell you, just taking a look at it. I had a great mentor. <laughs> I'll tell you, <laughs> a great mentor. It's just, it's beautiful. Yeah, thank you. I appreciate that. And it comes in multitudes of colors. Yeah, we have our standard colors, yep. and then we have our upgrade colors, mm -hmm. and then we also paint to match. So mm -hmm. you send us a sample, work with your dealer, we get the sample, we match it for you. Mm -hmm. uh, it's a little bit of an upgrade uh, mm -hmm. charge, but mm -hmm. we can match anything you send us. Mm -hmm. Well, folks, here it is. Alex. The new Wilson speaker from Daryl Wilson of Wilson Audio. Thank you for stopping by. Thank you very much for having us in your showroom. It's a stunner.